Hi everyone. Uh, I'm still playing with resonance. I have my uh, Dini wheel going, and uh, the generator coils are in resonance with these capacitors. And so we have an LC tank here with uh, with the green wires. Then I have uh, another resonance another LC tank here with this big coil and these capacitors uh, that's the white leads and it's uh, in resonance with, uh, uh, with the frequency that is three times high as the frequency on, on, on this uh, LC tank and the reason for this is that I have a spark gap that is feeding this tank in series the spark gap is across uh, the capacitor here and the reason that I do this is because um, what I get when I have a spark gap is something that looks like a square wave so if the base frequency of the square wave is uh, 150 Hertz uh, the next frequency within the square wave would be 450 50 Hertz so this tank is uh, tuned to 450 Hertz I also got a small coil there uh, on the core of this big one that is going to my oscilloscope and uh, you can see I have uh, the output from the Bedini motor the prime mover of this uh, thing and uh, the other wave is the pickup coil that is showing and I think it looks something as if I have a frequency that is three times the base frequency uh, kind of cool and uh, if I take this this uh, meter I get now. Let's see if it's, it's an AC. Here I have uh, it's picking up quite a lot of amps now and then. That's interesting. And here within the LC tank, I don't have that much. Um, just uh, just for reference. And, uh, but I think it's kind of cool that uh, I think. Um, more or less the first time that I've done something that I have some kind of math behind. That's cool. Thank you for watching.